Alright guys, just time for a quick update. Got some uh, packages in today and I've been saving up a few other things to uh, shoot a video of. So first, I got a couple commando locks from Patrick last week. First one is the NSN 5390 and this is the current production version. I uh, Very nice lock, has the uh, regular shackle. I've not been able to pick this, it's a very tough lock. Uh, again, this is what they have in stock right now. Then this is a Peacemaker prototype with the M1 keyway. Uh, I'm not sure if this has serrated key pins or not, but after a little bit I was able to pick this. And again, I'm looking forward to the uh, new padlock with the Y52 keyway. I think it uh, will be a great improvement along with the uh, 10 serrated pins and the different springs. Then uh, last week I got a couple of Medicos on eBay. These are two mortise cylinders uh, by Axial. They're key to like came with uh, one working key and there was also a five pin blank uh, I was hoping it would be a six pin blank so uh, was not able to use that it turns out that the blank was actually shaved down so it was uh, too uh, too thin even if I could cut it down to five have it cut to five pins the width of the blank was too sh was too small so uh, I don't know why anybody would do that but uh, so that in any case I have two locks with one working key which is not a big deal I took these apart cleaned them out they were full of graphite and dirt and uh, that leads me to this I ordered some some stuff from HL Flake I've got some blanks and springs and things but I heard a lot about this Houdini uh, spray so I had to pick up a can it was very reasonably priced uh, four-way lock lubricant protects cleans lubricates penetrates no Teflon no silicone no grease not sure what's in it to be honest if it doesn't have any of the good stuff but I'm gonna try this out uh, been using you know a combination of different things uh, engine bright for cleaning pins LPS for lubricating locks uh, PB blaster and croil for things that need to be unstuck um, like I said I've heard a lot of good things about this and I'm hoping it lives up to its name and I've just got you know nothing too exciting in here I got an American padlock that I bought for someone more blanks because I've got a bunch of locks that need keys made. A uh, couple different sizes of pins and springs. And a uh, new ratcheting screwdriver. This came from eBay. And I believe that is it, guys. The uh, evil Lockwood that I got from Eric, I have not been able to pick. It's in this bag. It's going back to him. Uh, I don't like to admit defeat, but it happens. So uh, the next person will definitely enjoy that lock because it puts up quite a fight. So as always, check out keypicking.com. And thanks for watching.